Hey everybody, it's Herc here and recently we sent out an email about uh, WP Tag Machine. It's a new little software app by Anchor Shukla and uh, it's pretty badass and um, it's only 20 bucks so uh, we wanted to tell you guys about it and show you why um, we think it's a pretty cool little app to have um, in your arsenal. So let me just give you an example of um, why we like it. But first of all, what it really does is it, it just gives you the ability to quickly and easily add tags to your posts. Now, why do you want tags on your posts? Um, what I'll do is I'm going to go to our um, SERP text site and we've seen this time and time and time again um, where if I look at um, you know our site and I look at some of the rankings like if I typed in my Sothelia Prosecutor in Ferndale you could see we're ranking um, the whole first page here. We actually have the whole first page but if you look it's a tag that's ranking, it's a tag that's ranking, it's a tag that's ranking, tag, 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 tag. Uh, everything on this page is um, a tag except for this one which is a category. So we also have another example here. Um, we have the first three rankings here, but all three of them are tags. So what we've noticed is that tags um, are actually ranking really, really well in Google for SERP tech sites, but that's not just because they're SERP tech sites, it's because you're using tags. And the cool thing about tags is that it actually allows you to expand on um, you know, a post that you have in WordPress with a tag which creates a URL which is able to index. So for instance, this particular um, tag URL is one of, let's go to the page and take a look at it. It's actually one of a whole bunch of tags that are actually attached to this particular post. Okay, so if I open this in, in a new window, okay, here's the actual post, right? But this particular um, one is a tag page because we created a tag as part of that post. So if I actually go back to the actual post, you can see all the tags here and down in the bottom right where my mouse is, is right here, as I'm scrolling over tags, you see that we have a URL for every tag. Now, this allows us um, to get a lot more URLs um, indexed in Google, which when you have more URLs indexed in Google, you have more keywords that you could possibly rank for and get more traffic. So tags are really, really working well. And out of all the thousands of builds that we've seen um, members do in SERP tech, um, this is why it's, a, or a big part of why, is because we're adding so many tags that are creating so many more URLs that are indexing in Google, thus creating more rankings, um, more traffic, and you can target more keywords. So that's why we like the plugin. Um, you can use WP Tag Machine on SERP tech builds, but I mean, SERP tech's already adding tags, so it's kind of more for uh, older money sites. And what I wanted to show you is um, how I've been setting them up, for example. So uh, Try Skinny Pills is one of my affiliate sites. And I haven't been taking advantage of tags, although I should be. Um, so what I did is I installed um, the plugin. I installed WP um, Tag Machine onto it. And then all you have to do to add the tags is go to your posts. And we can open up any post. So like say this um, Forskillin Fit Pro or whatever. So what I can do is edit this Forskillin Fit Pro. Okay. And then I scroll down inside of the post, it only works on posts, okay? And right here where it says search keywords, I can do for school in fit pro. Now I'd add a keyword that's very, very highly related to the content of the actual post, okay? And then I just go ahead and click search. And what it's gonna do is it's gonna find me a bunch of keywords that are all for school in fit pro keywords. And now I can select as many of these as I want and create tags with them. So let's just, for instance, select all 120, okay? And then we're gonna add those as tags, okay? So 120 tags are added. Now, how many tags should you have? Um, Anchor saying they recommend using no more than 20 tags to get the best results. Yes, adding 120 tags to a page might be overkill. So that's something you're gonna have to kind of play with um, to see how many tags that you should add. The other thing, um, let me refresh this page. Once I update it, um, you'll see right here, tags will actually, all these tags will show up and then I'll, I'll look at the post as well. Um, but the other thing is that um, you wanna be careful with how many tags you add. You wanna make sure you're adding relevant tags. Okay, so there's all the tags now. Um, but the other thing that's kind of important is you wanna make sure that the tags are actually showing up on your page. So um, one of the plugins that I added, I'm just gonna go to plugins here. Okay, and I'll show you guys this. It's a cool little tag manager called, uh, where is this guy? That's WP Tag Machine, that's the $20 plugin from Anchor. Uh, cool Tag Cloud, okay? Sorry about that, that's my door, it's just windy in my office. Um, so if you go and you add Cool Tag Cloud to your plugins, then um, when you go to your posts, 
Okay, we'll go back to that post. Okay, so now we see all our tags got added so we can view that post. What this tag cloud is actually gonna do is it's gonna create nice little tags on your sidebar. So it's a widget. So what, all I had to do to add it is go to my uh, widgets. Okay, and once I downloaded it, here it is, cool tag cloud. I added it to my, my widget area. Now you can also um, change things. There's a whole bunch of little default settings, maximum tags that you can show, 20, um, but they're all still there. They all can still index, but you can you can do it like that. Um, you can just add a nice little tag cl cloud um, to your site. And the purpose of doing that is so that you can index those URLs really, really quickly. So if spiders are already visiting your site, um, and then they'll see the new tags and they'll start to index those URLs and you guys will be able to get those um, inserted into Google. The other thing you guys can do, okay, is if you go to, you have um, Google XML sitemap, so let's install that plugin. Okay, so let's you know, add a new plugin. And this is, this is gonna be so that you guys can speed up your indexations, okay, of your new tags. So go to Google XML sitemaps or search for Google XML sitemaps plugin. Okay, and we're gonna activate that. Okay, now in your settings, go to XML sitemap. And what you're gonna to wanna to do is create your sitemap so that tags are included. Okay, so in your sitemap content setting, make sure that include tag pages is included in your sitemaps. Okay, and then we're gonna update our options. Okay, and then here's our sitemap. Okay, so what we can actually go do is right here, this URL where it says sitemap tax post tags, these are gonna be all our tags, okay? You can see all the tag formats. Now, once you build your tags, like I said, what you'll do is take this URL and then you're gonna to go to um, your search bar or whatever and type submit, oops, sorry about that. You're gonna type submit URL to Google, okay? And then all you're gonna do is put in the new um, link to your actual new tags obviously do the recapture thing, prove that you're not a robot, and then you wanna submit it, okay? And it may not be immediately, but it will come fast. So this is typically how you can um, really speed up the indexation of any new tags that you add to posts in your blogs, okay? So let's just go back into try skinny pills. All right. And these, uh, all these reviews are from Project Supremacy. So there's our tags, which is good. We have our tags submitted. So now that's gonna absolutely speed up um, the amount of time that it takes to uh, index your tags and hopefully start getting you guys more traffic. But there's one more thing. Um, a lot of people, so let's do this again for a different post here. Um, so Forskill in 1020s, let's go into our edit. Okay, and then we're gonna search for tags that are related to the content. So Forskill in 1020. Oh, sorry, that's the wrong area. Make sure you're in the right area. Search keywords, okay? Now, one of the things that we noticed is that um, nobody really knows what are the good tags to use, okay? So if it's if it's like, like in the last example, 120 tags came up, they're recommending only really using 20. Well, which are the best ones to use? Which are the ones that are gonna bring you more traffic? Well, the way to do that, um, what I'm gonna do is add these tags, okay? First of all, so there we go, the tags are now added. Um, what we're gonna do for you guys, for anyone that picks up this plugin, um, is we're gonna give you a way to be able to choose out of the tags that are getting found, which ones are the absolute best ones to go after. Because if you're only gonna be using 20, but it's searching and it's finding like 100, um, you don't really know which ones to pick, right? So what you're, we're gonna be able to do is you're gonna be able to download the tags. The plugin already has that feature. Okay, you can download it in a, in a new line format or a CSV format. Okay, but what's happening is we're already updating keyword supremacy, okay? And what we're adding, um, you can't really see it right here too well yet, but we're adding a new feature called import keywords into keyword supremacy so that when you download your list of tags um, from the tag manager, okay, so we went and found them, right? And then we downloaded them. Now, um, I think this is gonna be done Monday at the end of the day, it's already being worked on. Um, you're gonna be able to now import up to 370 keywords at a time into Keyword Supremacy, and then click on Get Metrics for that list of keywords. Then all you'd have to do is sort your keywords, okay, and choose the ones with the most traffic, and then come back and select those keywords, okay? So 
Um, that's gonna help you choose the highest traffic keywords or the lowest competition, highest traffic. You'll be able to see all those metrics in keyword supremacy. So that feature is actually being built this weekend um, to be able to import a list of keywords. Um, and what we're also gonna do for you guys is anyone who's already purchased this from us because we already have a whole bunch of people who have and anyone else that purchases from now on, we're also gonna add uh, 25 credits into your keywords supremacy account. And remember that credits are um, what you get um, what, or what you need in order to get all the competition. So let's, let's just do another um, example here. So I'm gonna just log into my keyword supremacy account. Okay, and I'll actually show you another way to find cool tags. So um, the new feature isn't in yet. So you're gonna see right here, there's gonna be under keyword search, there's gonna be import keywords, okay, on your account. Um, then let's just pretend like uh, we had a list of keywords imported. So like four skull in, okay. And then, and then I'll do a search and it'll give me a bunch of four skull in related keywords in keyword supremacy. Um, but once it finds the keywords to get all the metrics, it costs a single credit. And then it'll give you the CPC, the global, the local, and the, the AdWords competition for each of those, um, those keywords. So that's how you'll be able to know um, what are the best ones. So if you clicked get all metrics, your keywords would go into what's called a queued search. And when it was done, for instance, let's say Bitcoin was the search that we did instead of the other one, uh, you'll be able to filter stuff by, by search volume. Right, so you can see right here. So now you can choose the ones with the best CPC or the best local. You can even use the advanced filter and say, I only wanna look at keywords that have a cost per click of $2 or higher and a search volume of maybe, you know, a thousand or higher, okay? And then uh, those, there you go, 26 entries. Those would be the tags that you use. But the way it's gonna work with the tag manager um, is you're actually gonna do the search for your keyword in the tag manager for stolen. Okay, you'll do your search, you'll download that list of keywords, however many it is, you'll come over to Keyword Supremacy, you'll upload that list, you'll get the metrics, and then you'll come in here and use your filters. Um, once you've filtered the list down, let's raise this up a little bit and get rid of a couple more keywords. Okay, we'll go back down, maybe $3. Okay, then you would take this list of keywords, come back to your posts, and you'd know exactly which ones to select. Okay, that one I know is a good one, that one I know is a good one, that one I know is a good one. Those are gonna be the tags that you add. Those are gonna be the most important ones, okay? So that feature is gonna be here on Monday, and anyone that already has purchased Tag Manager, um, as well as anybody that purchases Tag Manager um, before the, uh, the offer closes, okay, uh, WP Tag Man Machine, um, we're gonna give you 25 free keyword supremacy credits so that you guys can go in and, and do searches for that. Now, the other thing as well, guys, I'm gonna just log out. If you don't already have a Keyword Supremacy account, okay, make sure you create a free account right here. Just go to app.keywordsupremacy and create a free account. What that'll allow you to do with the free account is it'll allow you to do as many keyword searches as you want, but without credits, you won't be able to get any of the metrics, okay? You won't be able to look up available domains or cost per click or local search volume, stuff like that, but you'll still be able to get ideas, kind of like what Keyword Manager or uh, the WP Tag Machine is doing. It gives you ideas, but Keyword Supremacy with credits is gonna give you the ability to get the metrics so that you know that the tags that you're using are absolutely the best ones. So. Um, that's it for this video guys. Hopefully you grab this tag machine, start adding tags to all your posts on all your affiliate sites, money sites, uh, AdSense sites, CPA sites, stuff like that. Uh, once again, you can add them to Servtech. I don't necessarily think it's a good idea, um, but feel free to do whatever you want. Um, for $20, it's just a really, really cool and quick way to get extra traffic um, and rankings to your site. So um, hopefully you guys pick that up and when you do, please send us a support ticket with your receipt and we will get you guys, also send us your username, okay, for Keyword Supremacy. Um, so let me actually write this down for you guys how, how this is gonna work. It's kinda like running a webinar right now. So uh, the, all the important notes are, okay, so um, it's like $20 to get the pro version um, or the unlimited version of Tag Machine. Okay, and where you wanna grab that is from this link right here. Okay. And then what you're gonna to wanna to do is install it and then you're gonna add any um, tag cloud plugin to display, that's gonna help you display your uh, tags on your posts, okay? Then you're gonna to wanna to make sure you download and install 
um, Google XML sitemaps plugin, okay? And make sure to include tags um, when you're building your sitemap. Okay, then what you're gonna wanna do to index your tags Okay, visit your sitemap and access the tags URL, okay, for your sitemap. And then um, once you're done there, go to, uh, go to Google or search Google for submit URL to Google, okay, and then submit your tags URL from your sitemap, okay. And that's going to help you. Um, that's going to help you get indexed in Google a lot faster with your new tags. Okay, and also if you don't already have a uh, keyword supremacy account, sign up here. We're going to go to keyword supremacy. Okay, app.keywordsupremacy.com and sign up. So then you want to purchase tag machine. You want to send in these things um, to us. You want us to get your bonus. So to get your bonus, send in a support ticket to http uh, supremacy.freshdesk.com. And the information you want to include is your uh, JVZoo receipt. Okay, you also want to include your keyword supremacy username. And what you're going to get for that, um, let's, let's make it like this, to get the 25 KWS credits bonus. Okay, that's what you're going to do. Purchase tag machine and then send a support ticket to supremacy.freshdesk, include your JVZoo receipt, include your keyword supremacy username, and we'll add 25 credits to your account. If you already have credits, go ahead and let us know. Uh, still give us your username, we'll just add 25 more. Okay, and then, so this, this whole video, it's already 20 minutes, wow. Um, the whole video is basically just to show you guys how to take that $20 tool tag machine and, and really start using tags to like uh, increase the amount of rankings and stuff you get in your posts. But the cool thing is we like it so much that we actually developed, um, we're quickly developing the ability to import the tags from W Machine into Keyword Supremacy so that you can filter out and find out which are the best tags to use on your sites. And then we're gonna give you the 25 credit bonus so that you guys can start uh, taking advantage of all that. So uh, happy Canada Day for all you Canadians. Have a wonderful July 4th weekend for all the Americans. Anybody outside of those two, just have a great weekend. And uh, we will see you guys, I guess, next week on the training. Okay, talk to you soon.